how to use Adobe Flash on your iPhone or iPad. Growing up, you might have come across Flash while playing a game or using an interactive site. But Adobe Flash never officially made it to iOS devices. Here's the only way to access Adobe Flash sites on your iPhone and iPad. Once upon a time, Adobe Flash was the de facto standard for delivering video, audio, animation, and interactive elements across the web. But then, thankfully, open standards like HTML5, CSS, and JavaScript came along. Adobe Flash was proprietary, slow, and consumed a lot of battery. It just didn't work well on mobile devices. Since then, the mobile web has thrived. Adobe is scheduled to officially sunset the Adobe Flash product in 2020. Major desktop browsers are now discontinuing support for Adobe Flash. Although you can manually re-enable Flash in Google Chrome, Apple devices like iPhone and iPad never officially supported Adobe Flash. In 2010, Steve Jobs wrote an open letter called Thoughts and Flash which still makes for a good read. In it, he outlined the reasons for not implementing Adobe Flash in Apple devices. Jobs had a couple of arguments, Adobe Flash was not an open platform, the Open H.264 video format was much better at delivering video than Flash, and when it came to games. There was the App Store. He also pointed out the issues with security, reliability, and performance. If you need to access an Adobe Flash site on your iPhone or iPad, you have several third-party options. Browsers such as the Puffin web browser comes with out-of-box support for Adobe Flash. Other browsers like Photon also offer this feature, but we recommend Puffin because it's highly rated and free. Technically, rather than running Flash on your iPad or iPhone, Puffin runs websites that use Flash on a remote server and streams you the video. From your end, you appear to be using a Flash-based website as normal, but all the heavy lifting happens remotely. To get started, open the App Store, search for Puffin Web Browser, and tap on the Get button to download the free browser. Here, enter the web address of the Flash site you want to visit. Tap on the Go button to open the website. The Flash site will now open. With all its components, you can tap on the Flash player part and then select Full Screen to open the game or the player in the full screen view. If you're using an iPhone, you should switch to the landscape view as Flash player usually works in a landscape widescreen format. Once you enter the full screen view, you will see two buttons on either side of the player. On the left is a button to access the keyboard. On the right is the menu button. The menu includes options to change the flash quality and to enable the on-screen mouse and the gamepad. Text source, howtogeek.com.